welcome to LCC TV's coverage of the Student Indie Film Festival, or SIF. The selection committee was very impressed with the films that were submitted. Of course, there's only so much time in assembly, and so it's not possible to present all of the films. Um, and so I'm going to select this one film that I think you should see. But if you'd like to see all of the others, then please, I invite you to check out sif.ca for all the films that were submitted and everything related to the SIF. So let's get started with the film I want to show you. This uh, film is by Trevor, graduating year pre-U 2021. Um, this film has gotten the award for Best Cinematography uh, and also also best documentary. So uh, it is called Nordic Ski Training once again by Trevor. Let's get started. Okay, so uh, today is a big training day. I'll be heading out this morning uh, for a speed workout, uh, which means uh, short intervals like 15 seconds, and that'll take about two hours and 45 minutes, three hours. Uh, then I'll come home, have lunch, uh, and have a nap, and then I'll head out again this afternoon uh, on the bike for a recovery ride, and that'll take about an hour and a half. Cross-country skiing is, it's different from a lot of sports in terms of just, I think, the endurance uh, that it takes. Uh, and then, and with that endurance, you know, very different from uh, other sports, such as hockey or basketball, where I think the uh, the exertion is, is kind of shorter bursts of energy. Um, and with cross-country skiing, it's typically sort of a sustained period of uh, energy exertion. So in terms of the training that you would do, that's geared towards that. So you would typically do long training sessions, um, sort of two to three, even four hour skis or roller skis or biking uh, in the off season. Uh, and then you would intersperse that obviously with, uh, with interval training. So I think just different really in terms of the endurance that cross country skiing takes. So these days cross country skiing, obviously you have really short races and then you have really long races. Uh, and uh, in terms of the longest races that are out there, I think there uh, were 50 kilometers was the longest race I did. And, uh, and that race, I think the fastest I, I've ever been able to do 50 kilometers is just under two hours, but the typical time would probably be about two and a half to three hours.
touch of skiing is a very different sport in terms of the training required. We'll do intervals that last from 15 seconds to 10 minutes. In order to be in the best shape possible for the races next winter, we'll do different length intervals over the course of the year. Typically a person my age will train around 750 hours in one year, but it's not just the amount of hours that's important. Technique is also super essential to going fast in the races without using too much energy. I hope one day I can get to a level where I can really inspire others in the sport of cross country skiing to become better. Thank you so much for having joined me for this episode. Uh, I really do encourage you to take a look at sip.ca for all things related to the Student Indie Film Festival. I also uh, encourage you to uh, take a look at the um, at, at the play release, well, the, the film released by the Ampersand Acting Club that will be uh, played on June the 2nd during Assembly. So look forward to that. Have a great day. Thank you so much.